The Washburn broke ground on a new indoor athletic facility back in March of 2019, and it's expected to be open by the end of October. KSNT Sports Director Pete Francis spent the afternoon at the facility, which will impact the University and Topeka in more ways than one. Washburn's $20.2 million indoor athletic facility is almost complete, and as you can see behind me, it's looking great. We got a sneak peek today. Let's take you inside. An absolute game changer. Washburn's facility features a practice field, a track, it will have four batting cages, and an athletic training room. It's unbelievable, and it, it really is. It, from the outside looking in, it's impressive. Then when you come inside, it definitely has a wow factor. It's almost hard to put into words of what this facility is going to do for my program. Few schools at the Division II level can match Washburn's new facility, which should be a major benefit in recruiting. You can bring them in here and show them. Uh, and it is, it, when you come in, I'm sure you guys had the same feeling. When you come in, there's a little bit of a wow, this is nice. The top recruits want to see that they're going to be taken care of when they're on campus for the next four or five years. And so now with a facility like this, we can, we can show them like, hey, our athletic department does support what we do. They do want us to be successful. The state-of-the-art facility has a 200-meter bank track, the only one in all of Division II, and it seats 1,500 fans, which makes this a perfect place to potentially hold an NCAA championship. We are able to bring in high, high-caliber meets now, whether it's national meets for Division II or junior college or Division III, NAIA high school meets, um, AAU things. Topeka also has the infrastructure in place to hold an event like that. We've got hotels, we've got places to eat, we've got a nice campus. In Topeka, Pete Francis, KSNT News.